Hello loves and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you everything that I have gotten so far for my aspiring nail tech career. <laughs> okay, so really quick I would just want to clear things out and just like just clear a lot out. So I mentioned in the video where I mentioned about being, being nail tech. I don't understand how people are still asking like if I'm going to go get my license if the whole video was about me working to get my license to become a nail tech. So, yes, I'm still, I literally have like all my equipment, but that's because I'm going to start by, you know, doing my own nails and practicing on family members. I have not said that I'm going to start taking appointments, etc, 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 no. All of this equipment that I have gotten so far is for myself so that I can practice on myself, like I said, on the little mannequin things. It's just for practice and then it'll become, you know, obviously handy in the future when I do become a nail tech with my license. So I also did mention that I am going to be going to school to get my nail tech license. So until I am licensed, then I will take appointments. And you know what? Like I've gotten a lot of people talking about that they would come see me, make the drive, make the flight just so I could do their nails. Oh my God, like to me, that's just, that just makes me want to get it even harder, okay? So that totally motivates me and just drives me to like, okay, let's do this. Let's make it happen, okay? So it is gonna happen. But yeah, all of the stuff, again is for myself at the moment until i get my license and then we could start talking about hey girl you trying to book me you trying to book me this week <laughs> tomorrow today right now okay so just want to let you guys know but also you guys also many of you guys want to know like where i have gotten my things so i will be all the things that I mentioned in this video will be linked down below, except for the things that I have found in a store. So I went to a local nail supply store out here in Chicago. I will list the address down below, and I, that's what we're going to start off with first because I just want to show you everything that I got there first because I can't link those things because... Um, I got it at the store but everything that i got on amazon i will link down in the description box below for you guys but if you guys are local out here in chicago and you guys want to get some like nail supplies for yourselves or for your clients uh whatever um i'm gonna leave the address down below it's called lee's nail supply store something like that so technically you have to have a nail tech license to purchase from there but they told me that they would sell me the stuff i told them it was for me because genuinely the, these things are for me <laughs> okay i have see i haven't even gone to go get my nails done i did manage to soak off uh these two that i was having a hard time taking off so i got those off so i have clean nails so i can start practicing myself before i start practicing myself i'm gonna do some mannequins first so yeah um but she told me that she would sell them to me but she wouldn't be able to give me a receipt so i was like cool that's fine because i already knew that the items that i was getting i already knew what i was getting and i'm not gonna return it like this is stuff that i need and um some people have also been like hey how do you know what to get girl i have been doing non-stop research on acrylics gels glitters what you need and whatnot so like that is really how i know how or, or like what to be getting okay so it's not like i'm just getting like a bunch of stuff and just like you know random stuff like no no like everything that i'm getting is for a purpose and i know what i'm getting so um I, i've been doing a lot of research <laughs> okay so anyways let's get started with this haul okay so here is the bag of stuff that i got from lee's nail supply store out here in chicago i got this barbicide container which is a glass container i'm going to show you what it looks like you guys have probably seen it at your local like barber shop this is what it looks like it's really really big i don't know how many ounces it is i think it's 32 I'm not so sure it doesn't say on here but i think it might be 32 and this is what it looks like it's really big and it goes up like that and basically what this is is so you could put or you could pour barbicide in there and i'm going to show you what barbicide is um this is what barbicide is and basically you pour two ounces in 32 on, in 32 ounces of water two ounces of this into 32 ounces of the water in here um two ounces of barbicide into 32 ounces of water inside this container and you basically just put in there like um nail clippers cuticle 
push back things and like steal stuff like that to disinfect it. Cuticle cutters, I think I just said that. Um, you put it in here for 10 minutes, it disinfects, you take it out, you dry them up, use my next client because infection control is the most important thing in doing nails. So I am sure, I was sure to like get this first before I start doing my nails um, just because I am very, <laughs> I'm very OCD and I'm like disinfecting and not catching infections or stuff like that. So I'm really, really careful. So I know that, you know, one of the, well, the most important thing on doing nails is making sure that all your supplies are always clean. So I got this bad boy and two of these actually. They sell bigger containers too and what I noticed, they also sell these on Amazon, but what I noticed is that if you guys can find a local nail shop, um, I mean nail supply store, go to it because this is much more uh, less pricey than on Amazon or like on website. Like this was $22 on Amazon and I found it for $14 at the nail supply store which is like, yes, way better. <laughs> Okay, it, and it's literally the same thing. And these are $4 each. And then I got these nail buffer squares. I got some off Amazon, but I picked up, I picked these up, um, just a little extra stuff. So I got another container of these. And I got these two containers. One is for acetone and the other one is for alcohol because we definitely want to know the difference between like what we're getting. Okay, so then I also picked up this Glam & Glitz liquid monomer. This is what it looks like. It's really small, how many ounces? 16 ounces. Just really small, just something to start off with because I don't want to get like a huge container right now. I just like want to start off with small amounts type thing. And then I also picked up this Glam & Glitz acrylic powder in the color medium pink. And I'm hoping that it's like a translucent, pink so like to, to do kind of like make a natural looking like nail and then i also picked up this mango body butter never tried it before but i love body butters and um it just caught my eye and i was like i gotta pick this up <laughs> okay now these guys i just need to show you how beautiful these glitters are like it was irresistible guys i just couldn't resist myself and they have many more colors and i was just like i wanted all of them like someday like i was envisioning all of these colors being hung up on my wall but like look at how beautiful these colors are this is this brand is create creation this is what it the brand is creation but look at how beautiful this glitter is oh my god it's so beautiful this is glitter 07 Okay, and this is glitter 15. Look at how beautiful that is. Oh my gosh, so beautiful. And then I picked this one up. Also, super duper beautiful. These do not have acrylic in them, so like you have to pick up acrylic and dip it in here. I don't want to pour it, but... So beautiful, guys. So, so beautiful. I can already imagine like all the things I can do with this, literally. And I think she threw this in there for free, but this is an OPI gel color. Oh no, I'm like she threw this in for free, but no, this is, this is, uh, I got these little containers to put the monomer in, even though I already have some, but I also thought that these were so cute because they're so tiny and she put them in here just so they wouldn't break. Cause I was like, did I get something for free? But this is what the, I picked two of them. Just for backups, just in case like one of them breaks or whatever, okay? So that is everything that I got from Lee's Supply Store. Now I'm going to show you everything that I got on Amazon. <sighs> Chapel's running around. Also, I almost forgot, guys. I also picked up this um, Petal Kolinsky brush in the number 10 also from Lee's Nail Supply Store here. Uh, I almost I could have thrown it away guys if I would have like picked up the bag, but this is what it looks like I just feel like this would kind of be the best brush for me to start with right now I also got another one But from Amazon I'll show you guys in a minute But like I feel like this is like the perfect brush to start off with for me Personally so I can have control of the acrylic beads when I pick them up. Um, it's really pretty too. It's in silver. I strive to be a good nail tech. Silver finishing, and then this is the tip. Obviously, like, there you go. 
I'm gonna have to clean it off to get like the white powder residue off of there, but this is what she looks like. So let's start off with this Air C. Okay, from now on and so forth, everything else that I got that I'm gonna show you uh, is from Amazon and I will have linked down below for you in case you guys are interested. So I got this Air C e file from Amazon, obviously, and it goes up to 3000 right here. Um, this is the on and off button. This is really dope because like this is this is the e-file, uh, but this is like, you can just put it in there like that. It does come with all these file bits or e-file bits um, that do change. So basically if you wanna change it, you could just, you twist this part right here and then it loosens up this one. And then you could put another bit in here, just like that. You could put it low or you could put it high. I like to keep it right here. And then you just lock it in place and it does not come off, okay? So I think that's really dope. And if you don't need to use it anymore, you just place it in there. It's not all over the place. And it does come with this like long cord. So it does stretch. And it also has the outlet cord right here, which I have plugged into the wall. But you plug it in and then it, um, it starts functioning and it also has a pedal, but I don't use it, so I put it away. But it does come with a foot pedal in which you can also control the, the volume, the speed on here as well. So this is really cool. Okay, so this is, where is it? This is the one I just picked up at the store. Okay, so these are the Mar, these, I picked up these Marquette, Marquette, like brushes to kind of like brush away any product that's on the finger or I don't know, maybe for gel colors as well. Or you can just like use, I, I don't know, I just find these to be very beneficial for like many things. So um, I got the packet, they all come in a packet all together. So they all do come like this. And then I also found this one on Amazon, which is a little bit lower quality than the one I just found at the store. But it is really, really cool anyways, just like start off, it's, it's very inexpensive and just so so pretty as you can see it's very mesmerizing look at that i found this really cute heart shape uh plastic like hand rest where like you could rest your hand so you know to do the nails kind of like so you don't keep them up like that so you just rest them and like just you know really chill really cute it's like it feels like memory foam it's not memory foam but like it just feels like that it's really comfortable but it's also very very pretty and very very girly okay now this is one of my favorite favorite pieces that I got on Amazon and I think this is so dope and okay I this is I'm gonna have a little bit of a hard time showing you but I'm gonna try my best and the sun is crazy so I just might have to this amazing amazing lamp okay so check it out so it folds in like this and when you want to use it you unfold it like that and you have the light up here and basically what you do is just touch, so you power it on, and it turns on just like that. And it has different modes, so it has like a warm, see, it has like a, a very warm color, a low warm color, and then it has a cool color, and then it has a bright, warm, coolish color, which is really, really dope and very, very nice and bright. So you can be able to see everything that you're doing, and if you want to dim it down, you just bring it down like that and it dims down. Or you could, you know, crank the volume up and make it a little brighter. But it's really, really cool and really, really convenient. Like I said, you could just fold it up, power it off, and it's out of your way. Uh, another really cool thing about it is that it has a USB back here where you could charge your phone or your client's phone whenever, you know, they're you're doing their thing and yeah it's just really really dope they all they also after i had purchased this one i had found another one where you could just set your phone here and it starts charging which is really 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 dope so if i could go back i would definitely get that one instead of this one but this one is still very very cool okay now how freaking cute is this guys like this is so cute okay well this came in a subscription box that i am enrolled in with my um planner so this is like i can't even like show you guys where i got this but um check this out how 
adorable is this and this is so you can put your monomer inside or whatever like honestly like if you guys don't even do nails this is so cute to like put jewelry inside like how freaking cute is that but this is where the monomer would be in so you can dip your uh brush in and pick up product so super cute and it's just so convenient that like i never thought that i was going to need this from like that subscription box but this is like literally the cutest thing ever ever it's like just put my my product on and then like there there you go okay now this is one of my favorite favorite pieces and this is this was the most expensive thing that i got out of everything that i've been purchasing and this is my dust collector and it is absolutely beautiful and basically when you're filing anything off of uh, anyone's nails or your nails um, this will collect all the dust so it doesn't go everywhere and you don't have to breathe it in and it's just super duper convenient and basically you turn it on right here and that is it functioning right there collecting and sucking in all of the dust and it does come with a cord that you plug in to the wall as well and it's like a i don't know like a gold like a rose gold type of color so pretty and here whenever it collect you know it collects a lot a lot of dust you can just throw this out and then you would just get a buy another one on amazon as well and then just put it in there the next thing that i got on amazon is this led led uv light for gel nails so you can like ooh, so you could <laughs> and it is sensor so like as soon as you put your hand in it will turn on and it's just so pretty as well and it does have different settings like 10 seconds 30 seconds 60 seconds and 90 seconds and it's just super cute it the it does come with different tops so it does come with a pink one a white one and a gray one and you can totally switch them off depending on the vibe or color theme that you have going on now in my drawers over here i have pink latex gloves just in case like you don't want to get product on yourself and um yeah in case you need it for anything i also got these cloth um face masks for myself and I think they also look pretty dope they're in the color black again I got these buffer files that I also picked up at the store but these I got off of Amazon and then I got these um, plastic sample color nails just to like hang up they do have a ring so you can hang them up so like you know when you go into your local nail tech store and they have like the colors and stuff that you can choose from off the wall these I've been having for a while. These are gel polish soak off nail foils. Been having them for a while. I think I got them at Sally's. These I got a pack of pink um, face masks for my clients or for well my future clients. I'm not gonna say clients because I'm not yet a nail tech, but like you know family or like future clients that are like either pregnant or they don't want to inhale any dust. You know just in case like if anybody wants one, I got I got you girl okay and then i'm buying a ton of these and these are this is basically the first thing that you do is you file off the top shiny coat and i got a bunch of them because i'm going to be very very careful on making sure that i switch off everyone's files like everyone is going to get a new file a brand new file so nothing's going to be reused everything is going to be brand new spanking new there will be major infection control when i am you know nail tech and basically these are like little brushes so you can you know wash your hands and stuff and this is to clean up uh, my supplies so i got two different types of nail tips i got these stiletto ones which look like this they're clear these are clear i got these in clear that's what they look like and then i got these natural nail looking tips which look like this i mean and they're squared so i got these two and then i also got this uh young nail clear powder for like i don't know so you could see like the it's, it's just a different finish this clear one than the regular uh, other milky white okay so it's the milky white and then there's the clear powder this is the clear one and i got a little container just because i you know starting off don't want to like go too crazy <laughs> start off okay start off little so i got that one and then i got this one glamming glitz color blend acrylic collection nail color i don't know i don't know the color but it's a touch of pink and i am just hoping it's like uh 
I don't know, like a translucent pink, but we'll find out, I guess, when, I don't know, I dip it into the monomer. But I did get one from the nail supply store, but in different colors, so I'm not sure what I'm going to see yet. And then I also picked up these Marquette uh, nail bits, which are in a really cool color, and this is what they look like. Really, really cool. Cool looking. They're like a nail chrome. And then I picked up this really dope um, nail clipper. Super cute. And then I got this cute little pusher with that looks like this. And then it came with this one, which cuticle cutter, or you could take off gems with this as well. And it just, I don't know, just the colors really fascinate me. <laughs> I love cool color stuff. I also got this Young Nail Protein Bond to prep the nail so that we don't get any lifting. And then I got this Kiara Sky Soak Off Gel Polish Non-Wipe. I've heard really good things about this one and about this brand. And then I got this OPI Pro Spa Nail and Cuticle Oil. Also picked up these glues, these key... KDS glues from Amazon. Also got these nail soakers. You clips, would you just like soak the soak the cotton in it and then put it on the nail and then just clip it on the nail so and then you just let them sit for a while so that the acrylics can come off. And then last but not least, I got these zebra files and I got a lot of them because like I said, I'm going to be using a new file for every person that I work on because like I said, infection control is very important. Okay. And basically that is it guys. Like that is literally everything that I have gotten so far. Okay, my loves, that is it for this video. That is everything that I got so far. Um, I didn't get any crystals yet, but like... You know, the more I advance in my career <laughs> doing my own nails, I will show you guys more like throughout my vlogs or like other videos. Um, but if you guys like this video and you guys found it helpful, go ahead and give it a huge thumbs up. I wonder if you could see me. It's like really, really bright. But go ahead and give this video a huge thumbs up. I hope that you found it helpful. Again, the links will be listed down below, except for the things that I bought at the store. I'm pretty sure you could... Google them and find them somewhere. But yeah, guys. Anyways, love you guys so, so much. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.